Today I'm going to show you how to laser engrave your designs onto irregular shapes, all while ensuring perfect alignment. So a while back, I was commissioned to laser engrave a number of plaques for the U.S. Air Force. But at the time, I didn't know how to perfectly align each graphic onto each plaque. But I thought about it a while, and I came up with a method that worked, and I've been using it ever since. And I know that other folks use a similar approach. But if you already own a Glowforge, you normally use the lid camera to position and align your graphics onto your material. It's fast, it's easy, and for most applications, the accuracy is nearly perfect, especially if you've calibrated your lid camera. That's something that I did recently, and it made all of the difference. Check this out. This is before, and that's after. But even with a perfectly calibrated camera, the challenge in lining things up manually is getting the rotation right. In other words, if you put your workpiece on your bed at even the slightest angle, it's going to be difficult to rotate your graphic to match the rotation of the piece. So to remedy this, we're gonna need this piece of paper and four magnets to create a simple template. But first, go cut out our shape over there on the CNC. Now that we have our shape cut out, we're going to place our piece of paper in the bed of the Glowforge and affix it using magnets. In the software, we need to score or cut the outline of our shape using low power as we really only want to leave a mark. And also, we're going to ignore the engraving in the meantime. And then run it. All right, so now we know exactly where we need to place our shapes. I'm gonna place them right here in our template, but this time we're gonna ignore the outlines and input our engraving settings in manually. Let's go see how this looks. This looks pretty good, what do you think? I'd love to hear your thoughts in the comments below. And if you have any other questions, feel free to reach out. I'm always happy to help. This about wraps it up. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.